Hey everybody, uh, I'm sure you guys are probably wondering what's up with the uh, thumbnail <laughs> and uh, about the uh, title. Um, we'll, we'll get to that here in just a second. Uh, but as you guys can see, um, I'm back with some more lottery tickets. I know it's been a while again. Um, and uh, yeah, I mean, I've, I'm doing okay physically, it's just mentally um in my head again uh like i was a while back ago um i don't know what's going on um but for some reason i just can't get out of my head and um but i'm trying I'm, i really am trying to keep these videos uh going for you guys and and everything but um yeah let's go ahead and talk about these lottery tickets first and then i'll get on to uh <laughs> to uh the profile picture i guess um as you can see we got uh some more of these 500 hundred dollar madness tickets or actually we only got one um i've played these several times and i can't remember if i've won on any of them i might have won like five bucks or ten bucks or something but i i can't really remember hell it could be that i haven't won anything <laughs> so we're gonna keep trying these uh, and then this Diamond Mine 50X, um, this actually looks a lot of fun, uh, got a whole bunch of ways that you can win and everything, uh, we'll see, where's the odds on these, 1 in 3.99, so for a $5 ticket, that's not too bad, which, what was the odds on, yeah, see, this is 1 in 4.21, so just a little bit better odds on these Diamond Mine 50X tickets, and then, uh, the old $20 ticket. Haven't played uh, one of these for a while, or at least not from what I can remember. But this is the uh, 2 Million Fabulous Fortune. Um, I'm guessing this one's new. Same with the 50X. Uh, yeah, the Diamond Mine 50X. Um, but yeah, these look like a, a lot of fun too. Uh, the overall odds on these is 1 in 3.69. And of course, we'll go ahead and start with the $5 tickets and move our way up to the $20 ticket. But now on to uh, why the title says, why hasn't anybody thought of this before? <laughs> and the thumbnail with the picture of a particular blue pill. Well, I was just sitting here thinking uh, a couple days ago, as a matter of fact, how... You know, th things are going in this world and and everything. And all these <laughs> political leaders, and I'm sure I'm probably going to catch a lot of hate for this or a lot of flack, but I just thought it was freaking hilarious. You know, and my thinking is, is that if we would give all these world leaders, not going to name names, or I'm going to try not to name names, but if all these world leaders had some Viagra, do you really think that they would probably have time to be sitting here wanting to start wars with other countries? I mean, everybody just think about it. If we would sit here and say, send so-and-so a lifetime supply of Vi Viagra, I would almost venture to bet, or I would like to bet, that he would start pulling troops out of Ukraine. Uh, you know, because he wouldn't have anything else to do besides trying to take care of his little hard problem. But, uh, <laughs> but yeah, I was just sitting there thinking of that. It's like, you know what? Hell, it, it might be a little costly, costly from the get-go. But just, you know, ship them a lifetime supply of Viagra. <clears throat> tell their significant other, wife, you know, girlfriend, husband, whatever they have. You know, be like, hey, we understand that you guys are making a humongous sacrifice. But the world will be a much better and much safer place you know and we can even throw them you know say a thousand bucks a month two thousand bucks a month just slide it under the table and tell them every time like i said because of your guys's sacrifices the world is a better place and a much safer place <laughs> but yeah I, I don't know i just thought that that would be kind of funny to to sit there and all of a sudden, you know, these world leaders just start receiving a lifetime supply of Viagra. And then all of a sudden, hey, world's at peace. <laughs> I mean, I don't think it's ever going to happen. But it would be it would be freaking hilarious. Or at least I think it would be hilarious to see that. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, 
But let's go ahead and get on to these uh, lottery tickets. I've already wasted enough of you guys' time. Uh, up here, we're looking for a coin symbol or a diamond symbol. You can either win 50 or 500 bucks. And we got strawberries. Down here, of course, is a numbers match game. Uh, or you can reveal a stack of cash, win five times the prize. It'll reveal that coveted $500 burst and win $500 automatically. And our winning numbers got 37, 25, 38, and 20. Starting us off with a 3, a 4, 18, 7, 23, 39, 8, 24, 13, 29, 36, 15, 6, 10, and 1. So, nope, $500 madness couldn't come through us for us again. Uh, I really like this ticket. I really want to win on it. I really do. <laughs> I don't know how many of these tickets I've played, but I have. I don't think I've come close. And thinking about it, I don't think I've, I've won on one yet, but... We're due. We are due. All right, guys. Now it's time for the Diamond Mine 50X. Over here, got a bonus. Uh, reveal a pickaxe. Instantly win $25. Uh, reveal it looks like a nugget. Uh, symbol win $100 automatically. Uh, and then down here, you need to reveal or uh, reveal three matching symbols in the same game when price shown. Reveal a diamond symbol. In any game, win five times the prize. Reveal two diamond symbols uh, in the same game, ten times the prize. And three diamond symbols, fifty times the prize. Uh, and then if you reveal a star symbol in any game, win all eighteen game prizes below. So, not too shabby. So, alright. We got a wallet. So, no bonus. But yeah, guys, uh, what do you guys think about that? Do you, how well do you think that would work? You know, because like, could you picture it? Like, literally sit there and pick, well, you might not want to picture it. But how funny would that be if, if said person in this world right now <coughs> would all of a sudden, you know, if he would receive a lifetime supply of Viagra, and then all of a sudden he comes on, you know, live news, you know, worldwide, saying that he's going to be pulling his troops out. Of, of, of Ukraine while sitting at his desk with this nice shitty smile on his face and we all know he's most likely receiving an old-fashioned Monica Lewinsky while he's sitting there telling us that he's pulling his troops, troops out of Ukraine but uh <laughs> now that would be hilarious not to throw Monica Lewinsky under the bus or anything but you know I just couldn't pass up saying that either I thought that was pretty funny <laughs> Uh, well, we got two like amounts there. Another two. Bell, bell, rainbow. Tree, tree, boot. Uh, cherry, necklace, necklace. Uh, oh, seven, fan, and fan. I gotta remember to pay attention to the diamonds. Uh, ice cream, save ice cream. Gift, seven gift. Uh, ring, safe, lightning. Oh, yeah, and the star. Man, this game might be dangerous for me. I'll, I'll probably end up forgetting or missing a whole bunch of stuff. And melon, melon coins. Trophy, trophy, banana. Trophy Club Club. Seven Crown Plum. Give Strawberry Strawberry. Cherry Cherry Lemon. Uh, lemon Plum Plum. Fan sh uh, Horseshoe and Rose. Then we got Rose Rose Gold. <laughs> I like that last one. Rose Rose Gold. 
But unfortunately, I don't believe I missed anything. I don't see a star, don't see any diamonds, don't see any three like amounts. So, unfortunately, this ticket is a loser. All right, so we got fast 100, fast 500, and fast 1,000. Reveal a 100 symbol, win a $100, 500, and 1,000. Uh, down here, of course, it's to match any of your numbers. Uh, reveal the gold bar symbol when the price shown. Uh, reveal a shield symbol when five times the price. Of course, a $500 burst when $500 burst or $500 automatically. And a uh, bag of money when uh, all 25 of your number prizes. All right. Hopefully, this $20 ticket's good to me. Oh, got a chest in the 100. Grapes in the 500. And a uh, clover in the thousand. I don't. I don't know what else to do besides, like I said, you know, give all these freaking political leaders. And the funny thing is, is that all wars, or most wars, are started because of who? Our political leaders. Are they the ones going in there and actually doing the fighting? No, hell no. Well, except, uh, God, I wish I knew. I could remember his last name. The president for Ukraine, you know, that, that man, I have to give that man props. Back in 2022 or whenever it was, whenever Putin decided to start the invasion, you know, Biden told him, hey, we got a helicopter coming or we can get you out of there. You know what that man said? No, he was going to stay and fight for his country, even though he was the president. Now that's ballsy. That really is. And that man deserves a round of a freaking applause because, hey, you know what? Yeah, he is the president, but he's got more balls than anybody else on this planet because he actually stayed and fought for what he wanted, fought for what he believed in. Our president? Oh, no, we got to protect our president with, with at all costs. You would never find our president out there freaking risking his life for us. Oh, hell no. Hell no. But... That's here nor there, and I'm sorry again about this rant, but it, it had to be done. I did, and I think, you know, I was sitting there talking about my depression and everything. <clears throat> I think it's just people in general. People in general are just so damn depressing, it's not even funny. You know, <laughs> I just, I, I, I don't know what to do anymore, you know. I, I appreciate you guys, though. I really do. And, and this isn't going out to any any of you guys, by the way. It's not. But, yeah, just like this, these lottery tickets are not good. <laughs> but, you know, I mean, I, I hope I sit here and, and I mean, it, like I said, it, this might piss a lot of you guys off. You guys might unsubscribe, not, not like watching my videos. But I've sat here and every time I've wanted to make a video and I just sit here and think about what's going on in this world, in this country. And it's just it's so depressing, so depressing that I'm just like, you know what, what, what's the point of going and buying lottery tickets and and putting them up, which that was a loser anyway, so... <laughs> But yeah, we have, this unfortunately, guys, this session was a was a big dud. But if you guys enjoyed the video, please give me a big thumbs up and smash that subscribe button. T thanks for watching, everybody.